All right, let's continue on this uh, cursed timeline of Into the Breach. We still need to get the... Have four enemies die from enemy fire in a single battle achievement. If we can get some more reactor, then we can power up Vec Hormones a whole bunch. But we've, we've got to have a good island. So I'm going to go... Oh, man, there's freaking centipedes and blobbers. We're going to go for... Oh, it's explosive scion. <laughs> um... We're gonna go for Archive Inc. Island. Let's let's cool it a little bit and see what happens. Tidal waves kill seven enemies. With the ability to blow twice in a turn, we might be able to actually do this. Every turn though is gonna be blow up, blow up, blow up, blow up, blow up. And even though there's fewer turns, we have two actions per turn with blowing, we might be able to push everyone into the pit. So you're dead. You just need to get blown and shot. You're gonna get blown. You're gonna get blown. Okay. At least we know how we're starting this. In fact, I'm like, what if we have you block a spawn? Seems nice. Well, um... Could also, like, shoot some of these enemies, but they're not, they're not attacking each other. There's no way we can get them to shoot each other, so let's not even worry about that. Let's, let's start with the blow that we know has to happen. Then, oh, you know what? I, sh I really should have gotten the time pod first. That's my bad. Oh, well. Uh, then you toss you to block a spawn. We'll take one damage, but that's okay. And then you... You can't... Oh, you're gonna take two damage, huh? Oh my lord, this is maybe not the best. Um, can you, uh, can you do something? That doesn't seem good. Yeah, blow up the time pod. I guess we're just gonna let the time pod sit for a minute. I really should have made a different early action, but that's okay. If I blow everyone down, eh, that's not gonna do anything. I guess you can just come over here a little bit. I don't know, should I should I undo to get the time pod? Honestly, I am. Should have done it like this first. And let's move the gravity mechs so that they're not stuck getting shot. So we're gonna we're gonna make a couple of of modifications here. And now that we've gotten rid of the time pod, I can make sure that this hornet dies, which is quite nice. That's a much better opening because I, I fixed the mistake that I made. Now, I don't know if I can kill seven enemies, but I'm hoping I can with the, uh, with the wind torrent, but we'll see. I mean, I, I have to kill all of these enemies plus the new ones that are spawning. That's the wrong place for the blob, and you know it. You know it! But, how about this? <laughs> Just blow them all down. And then... Can kill you. Two kills, you're gonna live, you're gonna live. I have to kill everything on the next turn. But if they're ground units, I can do it. Hopefully you have four movement. If they're ground units, I can do it. And they are ground units. Oh man, I don't know, can I? I mean, you're, you're in the drink and you can't move. Okay, so we, we can't do it. But I can, I can at least save all the buildings, you know? They're all... You're not saved. Warning, buildings are not saved. I use my turn reset, you're waterlogged. God damn it. <laughs> yeah. Ah, it's just a couple of buildings. No, yeah. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Um, kickoff boosters? No, that's not gonna do it. Like, is there any way that I can do this? 
I think the answer is no. This is this has been the the worst campaign that I've done so far. <laughs> Bar none. Bar none. The the only hope I have is that we can get this achievement done and then just like do the final island and be done with it. Hermes engines. Well, we don't have something capable of using that. We did get a reactor core though, which can go to Vec hormones. No, oh, actually, click the button. And be, oh, I'm I'm gonna try to. Oh my God! Five enemies that we can't. We can't. I'm gonna try and um, just beeline the. Yeah, it's fine. I'm just gonna try to beeline the um, objective of having the enemies kill each other. I, I, I don't think there's any reason to to not try to just go all in for it at this point. You know, it, we we know that we need this to to complete our objectives. Let's just try to do it. So, shiver me timbers, where are we blown down? If we blow everything up left, we can break the blob. And then if I shoot you over one, you will shoot and acidify the blobber. But that's not good enough. Because you're going to get healed. If I move everyone up right, I can still push you into a position where you're going to hit the blobber. You know, I, I like the idea of making the centipede hit the blobber, though, because um, if I do it correctly, the blobber will... Um, be on the spawn tile. You know what I also like? Just straight up murdering the Scion. So if we move up left, then down right, get everyone back into their original positions, shoot here to move you, kill the Scion, toss the Scorpion over the Scion. Oh, if I toss the Scorpion over the Scion, I die. So let's not do that. We don't have any health, do we? What about um, upright up? Upright. What about downright? Downright. You'll hit the blobber. You'll hit a building. We can't do that. And unless I move you, I, I can move you over one. Move everyone downright. <sighs> move you up out of the way. Shoot the scion. Move everyone downright. If I move you up, the blob is gonna get me. I can just chuck the blob. I, I actually think this is a, a good way of doing it. Down right, down right, and I just gotta move myself once. Yeah, don't don't break your tank. Yeah, okay, we, we, we gotta we gotta like move first, actually. Don't let yourself on fire. Okay, down right. Okay, you gotta move out of the way too. <laughs> you also have kickoff boosters. Oh, you know what? Kickoff booster over here? Oh, I like it, I like it. Oh, I, I like this so much. I love this. Cause now, Because then we can hit here. Push everyone over a little bit. So it will do one damage to us, but that's not too bad. Then... Kill the Scion. Hit the Scorpion. Who... Isn't dead. If, if I end turn here, though, you will die and we'll block the spawn. The Blobber will live, but there's only gonna be two units next turn. This actually feels like a pretty okay turn, but if I move everyone down right, the Scorpion is already dead due to the fire, and then the Blobber is gonna be acidified. I think this is okay. You can just repair, since you have two actions, and turn. That's a surprisingly good turn one, but it's also thanks to the artillery support. Thank you very much. You're gonna be acidified. Hopefully, you die to the, your centipede friend. 
I'm, I'm also going to try to make the blobs attack other units because if the blob explodes into another unit, you know, that that's good, that's good for us. It does more damage. So like here, if I go down right, down right, the blob will explode into the blobber. You're gonna be in the way, but I can I can possibly deal with that. It's gonna be down right, move you out of the way. I'll have to throw you up. Yeah, I'll have to throw you up and then move down right again. Ah, but if I do that, I will be acidified. Am I willing to get acidified? Kind of. If I blow everyone up right, though, I do block two spawns, but we're not blocking the uh, centipede shot. Move upright. I think we want downright, downright, and get acidified, because it means that means that we kill the blobber. Oh, next turn's gonna blow. Now, I do have to deal with you too, unfortunately. But if I move down right, I I can just straight up kill you with a single shot. Oh, but if I move down right and kill you with a single shot, then the blob is also gonna die, because it's gonna be here and sh get shot into a mountain. So I, I have to throw you to do two damage to you, which won't kill you, but th that's fine. Don't forget you have kickoff boosters, so if you want you can boost... Yeah, 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 yeah. Boost the bomb down, then we don't have to move again with with the, the tank. We don't have to move everyone, everyone down right, we can just stay where we are. So you're gonna explode and kill your friend. I... can shoot here. Do damage to, to this, this dude. And then I can also just move back a little bit. Now we're not getting hit by the centipede who's still blocking a spawn. The blobber's dead. You've got one HP. <laughs> I mean, it seems good. End turn. Wait, undo move? Why don't you just kill this guy? That's much better. End turn. It is weird, man. What's our what's our team kill look like? Three! We're gonna get the achievement. Oh thank god. We're gonna we're gonna be done with this campaign one way or another. <laughs> okay, if I move everyone up left, up left, you're not hitting a building anymore, and you're not hitting a building anymore. It's probably a better way of doing it though. Like if I um, your attack order is one. Like if I make you hit the hornet. And then do two damage to the hornet, it'll die, and I just have to move everything up left, up left. Oh, that's so good. Like, you flip him over, he shoots first, we move everyone up left, and then you don't hit a building anymore. I take a pot shot at you, you're gonna die to the shot. Then all we gotta deal with is you. You're already blocking a spawn, but I could just, like, hang out in front of you, because it. No, I don't. I can still shoot you though, I can still shoot you. It's gonna be, um, it's gonna be like here and I can shoot you over one. Okay, okay, okay. So, sh okay, okay, okay. <laughs> We're gonna be acidified, but that's fine. So move everyone up left. No, 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 no. You gotta move there. Let's start with this. This is our first move. We're gonna move everyone up left. Then you move up one, you move here, you flip. You're gonna kill the hornet, and the hornet's gonna die before it attacks. You're hitting a mountain. 
I have another action. What do I want to do with this action? I don't know. I, I can't do anything with it because I'm I'm in the perfect gap here. So you might as well just like repair your acid and turn. Why is this such an easy mission? <laughs> it's probably the artillery bot. You know, the artillery supports uh, enabling me to do some damage. Who would have thought a little bit of damage being done would have been so freaking helpful? Now there's five enemies though, but we do have infinite movement still. So I'm thinking upright, but we should move. Oh, we can't. Maybe, um, don't, can't, can't move down right. I can move everyone once though. Okay. Can't kill you. Can kill you. So there's a kill if we need it. Mm, that's not good enough. Although, that, oh, that's not good enough because you freaking move, you dummy. What about this? That's pretty good. Get a kill, get him down to one HP. Then you can flip him. Then you can move here and shoot him. And then you move everything down right one and then we're safe. The, the artillery support will take one damage, but everything else should be fine. Moving everyone down right one after you're dead. Yeah, you'll take no damage. Okay. I think we're actually okay. <laughs> so we um, undo moves. Start here. You might as well get a kill because you have nothing else to do. Although, I suppose you could just do this to make... Oh no, we gotta kill you so that you don't hit anything. And then what are you doing? You're gonna move down right one. So let's, let's do that. Let's just move everything down right one. If I do it again, though, you will kill your friend. Is it worth it? Probably not. Ah, but I can't kill you now. Ah, but I'm I'm free. Okay, so being free helps me a lot here. I got the achievement, so you know what? <laughs> Just kill him the old-fashioned way. <laughs> What's what's the most surprising is that we're at full health and we took no building damage from that, but that's actually pretty good. <laughs> okay, okay. I'm doing a lot of like game focusing here, not a lot of chat focusing on Twitch right now, but you know what? <laughs> Chat's not talking about anything very like appealing to the conversation. Just talking about themselves. Oh, man. <laughs> what a, what a, what a strange set of missions, but we're still in this. Defend the train? We didn't quite do that last time, did we? Do not kill a volatile Vec? Yeah, no, he's gonna explode. Oh my god. <laughs> Defend the train, I guess. Oh my god, Blobber and Centipede? I made a mistake. I have made one hell of a mistake. It's a time pod. Well, as long as nothing steps on it, it'll be fine. Actually, if I just step out of the way, you'll attack each other. You're all just kind of attacking each other. This is a really strange, like, turn one. So if I move everyone down left, you'll dunk. If I move everyone up left, you'll get close to being dunked, and I can shoot you into the dunk. We don't have to worry about the achievement anymore. We've got the achievement. So what we should do is just try to get whatever kills we can whenever we can get them. So I'm thinking, a shot here kills you and kills this thing. We can um, probably most easily do it like this. Easy, easy stuff. You can shoot your friend, your friend can shoot you. We can do that like this. Actually, we can do it like this with the booster. How are we gonna deal with you?
Like, if I boost you up, I... No, 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 no. I think the Blobber is going to have to live for a turn, because I don't think I can knock it away. You know what? We we should do it like this so that you die. No, we're going to block a spawn anyways. We'll just block a spawn. It's a weird, like, early turn here, but... Everything will work. What are you going to do? What is the gravity mech going to do? I can't let the gravity mech not do anything. If I move everything down right, you automatically die, you automatically block the spawn, and then I can chuck you over. That's way better. <laughs> you you explode, but, you know, who cares? The train moves after you. Is that where I want you to stand, though, is the only question? I don't know, I might rather have you go, like, into a corner, so you have more room to, to actually do your, your moves. But we'll start here. That's highly great. You'll get flipped. Now, you're killing your friend, you're taking two damage. And then you... You're exploding, so you're not gonna be there. You could just, like, shoot the blobber a little bit. It's not great, but you can do some damage to him. Or you could block the spawn, or you can get the time pod. I suppose I would rather you block the spawn and make sure that this guy... No, no, no. You're gonna live. Undo move. I guess I'd rather hit the blobber and make sure he dies. I wish that was water, but just not... What the heck are you gonna do? You have, you have like no action, no good action. I guess you'll get the time pot and do damage. Seems like a good, good way of doing things. Now, just to confirm, four, five, you're gonna explode. Okay, end turn. You actually took no damage, but that's okay. Okay, are you gonna shoot here and try to hit the train? No, you're gonna hit the train. Okay. No, you're also hitting the train. That's fine. This is what the the super extra movement is for. In fact, I kind of know what I want to do already. Move everyone up right and then up left. You'll get dunked. You can just move. If I move everyone up right, three movement. One. You won't do it. What about moving you upright, and then you can just... Three movement. One, two, three. You can dunk the blobber, and then we can do something else with our turn. Like move, not up left, but like down right. Then you block a spawn, and you kill the blood scion. <sighs> Man, the double wind torrent is finally working! We don't want to move down right, though. Oh, we can just move. We can kill the freaking blob. Whatever. So then you come down here. Dunk him. And then if we move everything down right, we can just stand here and toss the bomb. We'll take one damage in the process if we move everything down right. Oh, you're not going to hit the freaking Scion. He's right there. What am I thinking? Why am I talking like this? What a, yeah, I still like it though. Because you blocked the spawn. We break the mountain, but who cares? Um, well, hold up. You think that there's like a better way of doing this? Like, can we make the blob hit the hornet? Uh, maybe we could have if we actually did a different action. But I'm just gonna just gonna chuck it. Just break it. Everything's looking fine. Nothing's taking damage. We only have to survive for a single more turn. You regenerate, but who cares? You're probably going to live through this uh, mission anyways. I don't know, I was just reading. <laughs> that it all went away. You're hitting a building. You're hitting a building. 
you're hitting a building. Move everything upright and then chuck you into the water. That seems like a great move. In fact, I'll start with this. Goodbye. And then move everyone up right, or up left rather. Let's um, let's get you out of the way. Uh, yeah. Nothing's taking damage. We can kill the Scion. Might as well. Wound another mountain. End turn. We actually, we've completed missions. Have we failed any objectives on this one yet? On this uh, island? Because it would be lovely to get a perfect island. Disposable account says the train status effect is literally called Choo Choo. The attack from the train is indeed called Choo Choo. <laughs> that is true. Science. Shield projector. I don't see that really being used because we have Vec Hormones. Although, I suppose we could put Vec Hormones on here instead of kickoff boosters, but... It's going to require a lot of power to use this. Although, having a second attack that's not Wind Torrent is nice when we have double shot. Like, we could shield a building and then move. You know, it, it, it doesn't sound like a bad idea. Just do this. And you got a shield projector now. We can make that shield projector very big, too. You know, I, I kind of like it. I know we need other, like, power, but... Things are, things are going rather well so far. Do you think we can defend the tanks? Oh, hell no. Oh my god, no. Um, but I'm gonna try it anyways. Yeah, we we failed the perfect island, so let's give this one a shot. If, if we lose a tank, we don't really lose much. Oh my god, that being said, look at this freaking mission, dude. Oh my lord, let's let's see what happens. I, I basically can only push up right and up left, otherwise this tank dies anyways. If we can live for two turns, that tank will come back to life though. Wow, like all of my units need to be like back in order to function, except for the judo mech. And the judo mech can leap, so he, he can be kind of far back too. And the blobber is going to probably plant a blob here. Although, if I can get you to plant a blob here, that would probably be better. Let's see what happens. This might not be the best spot. Ah, oh, yeah, because you're just going to get webbed. Unless you go for the tank, I suppose. Okay, that's where I wanted the blob, at least. Are you going to go for the tank or my, my grav mech? Yeah... Yeah, we're gonna take a lethal hit. We're gonna take a lethal hit, so we gotta do something about that. I messed that up slightly. But we can still move stuff around. So, for instance, we can move everything... upright. That saves the buildings. You can do this, which will save the tank. If only there's a way I could light you on fire first, but if we do this, that's fine. So we move everything upright after we move out of this position. We move everything up left? No, we'll hit a building, so we gotta move first anyways. Move everything upright, you're not doing anything. You're not doing anything, you're not doing anything. Um... I can kick off Booster to make them attack each other. In fact, I can kick off Booster to make them kill the blobber. So we're gonna start here. You're gonna move out of the way. Like, big time out of the way. Yeah, here, why not? And then move up. Uh, you're gonna hit a building, huh? It's always something that I forget about, huh? <laughs> so you're gonna hit a building, huh? You know, I, 
honestly, I still think you do it. I still think this is the right call because we can still do everything else we want to do on this turn. I can, I can kick off booster so that you kill the blobber, which saves the tank. You're not hitting anything. You're not hitting anything. If we undo, what are we going to change? Not much. So honestly, we're just going to do the same thing. We just, we just know ahead of time that this is going to hit a building. And our grid defense is, is that 20? Oh, it's so low. And then we're going to kick off booster in this direction. Oh, you know what? If I kick off booster here, you just hit a building. So I have to do it like this. Oh, I'm so mad at myself. At least you hurt the other units, but yeah, this is, um, this is a little scary. You do four damage, which is not quite enough for a kill, but if I push the Hornet into something, it can die. You're in a building. You're blobbing. Upright move is what we're probably gonna do. Still works, but we have to free our tank. You're hitting nothing. You're hitting that tank. You're hitting that. Okay, so what if we push everything what if we push everything down? Is that good enough? Probably not. What if we booster jump here? You block the shot, take four damage. You move. Blow everything upright. Saves this building. You push him down. You kill each other. I mean, sounds like it works. You save that. Push everything up right. But first, you gotta, oh, if I do that, you'll die. No, you're not, you're armored, you're, you'll be fine. Well, no, you'll kill yourself if you do that. Damn it. No, it still works, it still works. Just gotta do it like this. Actually, we don't even need to push anything with the gravity mech. The gravity mech could, could shield? I didn't think that would happen, but yeah, the gravity mech can just shield. I guess you're not killing each other, but that's fine. Mech HP is quite nice. You're gonna take four damage. End turn, we have a bunch of shields out. So we lost one building power, but that's not too bad. I wonder if maybe there was like a shield opportunity in there somewhere else, like on the first turn that I didn't see. But I had to move my, my mech, so I don't think there was. I had to move the gravity mech because he was getting hit. Are they really just gonna like... block us in? <laughs> like a bunch of jerks? <laughs> At least we've got the stock cannon. Okay, push you, you do that. You're gonna kill both of these units if I blow everyone down one. Well, no, because what we can do is we can just jump. You're going to explode and kill the Scion. Actually, what we're probably going to do is move you so that you die, and you're just going to move, you're just going to walk out of the way. So you're going to leap. Actually, I don't even have to move the sign. The sign's already gonna die. So you're dying to that. You're dying to that. You're dying to that. Oh my God, as soon as you get these tanks out, <laughs> it's like, I can do things. And then honestly, like, kinda wanna just light you on fire. And then you can just move off to the side so you don't get smacked. We could move everything, but there's no point. Actually, if I move everything down right and then down left.
we block a spawn, but let's be honest, I don't think we need to worry about that. I think we're okay. Just end turn. So you're gonna kill him and break a couple of shields, but that's fine. You're gonna kill him, you're gonna kill him. You're gonna attack nothing, end turn. Losing, losing one power is fine. Losing one power is fine. We should have done this mission like first, this island rather. <laughs> okay. Technically, if I stand still, we're okay. But I would certainly love to make you guys kill each other. So, what if we do that? How would we do that? Because you only do one damage, you'll only do two to this Firefly. You're on fire. If I push you, you'll probably die. Well, you'll get really close. You'll get really close. How much damage do you do? Three? I'd rather you not kill me. Let's do it like this. Good enough. <laughs> we'll just uh, try to, you know, absorb the shot. Three, four. Yes, yeah, so you're going to attack first. Why are you going to take no damage from this? You're going to take no damage but be acidified? It makes no sense. Whatever. As long as you're dying, I'm happy. So you took one. Oh, th both of those enemies were acidified. That's why. They were already acidified. Okay, we got the tanks. We got the robot lab. Surprisingly, we got another reactor core, which needs to go into... I was going to say Vec Hormones, but I think it actually needs to go into Move. Yeah. You do need the Move. Alright. Corporate HQ. Hornet Leader. A, a generous layout of the mission, too, which I can certainly appreciate. I'm, I'm seeing a lot of blowing in my future, let's just say that. I like it. And... Perfect. We can probably make the centipede hit his friend. Oh, we can certainly make the centipede hit his friend. What do you do? Acid? Two damage plus acid? I like it. I was thinking about killing you, but no, I think I'm just going to let you live, my friend. Live, my friend. And we'll block a spawn, because I'm just going to blow everything down right one. So we'll give you a toss. You'll also be on fire, which I didn't think about. Um, I guess I could just, like, shoot you over one, but I'd rather shoot you over one so that you block a spawn. Actually, if I blow over one down right one, that'll happen anyways. So that's just a beautiful turn, and um, you know I could have done it lighting this force tile on fire. Instead, I am going to uh, light it on fire anyways. I think. I don't think there's anything else I want to do. Just end turn. Yeah, if we lit that on fire, that scorpion would be on fire, but I'm, I'm happy with where we are. Someone add that quote. I'm seeing a lot of blowing in my future. <laughs> you got a problem? You got a problem? Centipede, where's the Hornet? There's a the Hornet. The Hornet's only got two HP, so it's gonna die very shortly. In fact, if I move everything up left, the Centipede will kill the Hornet. Ah, but you're not. Move everything down right, same thing will happen. Beautiful, okay. So we're gonna move everything down right one, which should save us. 
Or what about moving... Nah, it's gotta be down right. But I'd l I would love to just light you on fire first. You're gonna kill your friend. You're gonna burn to death in two turns. You're burning to death. And you might as well just chill out. And turn. Nothing's taking damage. You love to see it. There's gonna be a lot of acid everywhere, but that probably works into my favor. And even if a uh, even if a scion spawns, he's not gonna be able to save anyone. They're all dead. You're dead. You have to take one damage. You're dead. You're easy to kill because I can just dunk you. fact, I can get multiple dunks, which is kind of kind of nice because this unit does need the experience. Though I would love to dunk myself. Or to do the dunking myself. <laughs> so I'm like, what if we uh, what if we blow? We're gonna be acidified, but that's fine. You're already dead. I didn't mean to be on fire, but that's fine. You are, you're dead in two turns. Let's move out of here. Give a little bit of a booster. Get some experience, get a little bit of a repair in. You're already dead. You're burning, right? Yeah. And you're burning. End turn. Action available, but I don't want to spend any actions right now. Especially not with my units burning, we'll just wait. Arnine says, I have an Instagram if you all want to follow. Jenna's crochet underscore channel Instagram. You know what? I'll have to check out your crochet of Woodstock and Snoopy. <laughs> Sounds good to me. Oh, you're gonna murder your friend. I love it when they just kill each other. Repair. Repair. We good? You're dying. You're gonna kill your friend. You're exploding into nothing. We're gonna make it out of this island. Not perfect. None of these islands have been perfect, but at least we have been getting enough reactor power and reputation that I feel a little bit better now than I than I was earlier. Than I was on the last island. Good lord. Again, like, there's a reason why I think at this point I understand that you kind of want to do the islands in a specific order, because they suck if you don't. Okay, Titanite Blade. Oh my god, having an actual attack would be phenomenal. But I think I'm just going to go for reactor power, because we need plus one damage, we need plus one damage. So, honestly, come, come, come. Now the siege mech is so much better doing two damage. My lord. We should have had this thing upgraded a long time ago, but we just couldn't. At least we got it now. So, um, yeah. Let's leave island. That was a quick little spend there, but, you know, there's nothing else to do.